Taurus, what's going on with you? This is gonna be such a random reading, okay? I haven't done something like this. Oh, actually, what am I doing, Taurus? This is for the cross watcher, actually. This is for the cross watcher. Whomever is dealing with a Taurian. Taurus, get out of here. This is not your reading. What's going on? So, it's gonna be a quick wham bam reading. What's going on, crosswatcher? What's going on, Crosswatcher? I hope it's not, it's not gonna be like the, the Virgo reading where I was talking so fast that words were overlapping. All right, Crosswatcher, what's going on with Taurus? What energy is Taurus projecting towards whomever it is that they're involved with? <clears throat> what energy is Taurus projecting towards the individual that they're involved with? <clears throat> All right. Hmm. Hopeful. Well, very hopeful. All right, guys. Hmm. So I get the sense that there isn't communication going on at this time. There's a bit of frictional energy here coming from Taurus. Yeah. Um, with that said, really what's needed within the situation is a resurrection. It's a resurrection, like a re really what's on the surface is a reconciliation that that is within their you know energy field. It says if they're hopeful in regards to this, <clears throat> yeah, they're even compelled to taking action towards this. Interesting. What actions is Taurus taking towards their potential suitor during this time? Let's take a look, Crosswatcher. What action? Will Taurus be taken towards their potential sooner during this time? Let's see. Mm -hmm. All right. Reconciliation, guys. Reconciling uh, a problem. I like the word rectifying better. Rectifying a a problem is what I'm seeing here. All right, so what actions are, are they more most probably going to take towards you, Crosswatcher, is that they're gonna to move towards fixing something. I'm telling you, there needs to be a sense of balance attained here between you and them for whatever reason, okay? <clears throat> tell me more, tell me more. Uh, Taurus, what are Taurus's feelings towards this individual? Deep down, deep down, what are their feelings towards them? So their feelings in regards to you, Crosswatcher. Yeah, they're a bit dubious. They're in uh, in a in a point of making a decision here in regards to walking away, walking away from a very very stressful situation. All right. So despite their energy being this propensity to make something happen with you to resurrect a situation. All right. Emotionally, they're dubious. Why? Because. They're focused on the negative that has ensued between you and them. That is what I'm seeing here. It's like Taurus is focused on the negativity and emotionally, that's only going to stir negativity. So what I'm picking up here in regards to their emotions is self-imposed negativity regarding you. All right. <clears throat> now, Crosswatcher, what is it that you can do? What energy? Can you embody <clears throat> what is it that you can do so that you align yourself with having a great relationship with this Taurus that you're interested in? Let's see. What is it that you can do to facilitate a good relationship with Taurus? Get two more. All right, going within, man, going within. All right, guys, so look, Crosswatcher, I'm getting the sense that there's been a bit of loss of passion, all right, within you for Cancer, I mean, uh, for Taurus, okay? It's really a matter of going deep within yourself. There's some emotions that need to be mended within you, 
aside from the relationship, I mean, it's pretty fucking clear that the relationship needs mending it itself. But in regards to you, don't think about approaching this relationship until you've you've come to a place of emotional harmony within yourself, and you're only going to do that through isolation, through solitary, through being solitary, and actually going within. All right, going within. And what do you, what what can you do? What does that look like? What does going within look like? Is actually sitting on yourself and thinking about it. Do I really want this person in my life? Do I really want to pursue this individual? You know, is this individual even, you know, someone that I should pour so much time and energy into? Ask yourself such questions. Dig deep within yourself. And if you truly want Taurus in your life, well, there you go. You're only simply aligning yourself. You're aligning yourself with this. It doesn't seem it doesn't seem as if you're in the position to make communication, guys. All right. And it's not because of, of anything external from you. It's not because the relationship is in a, you know, is, is in a period of disharmony. It's, that, that's, it's not because of that. It's because of a loss of passion within you. All right. I'm getting this energy from, from you, Crosswatcher, that, that it's as if, if you were about Taurus, if, if you were full on like, I want this individual in my life, you would go for it. You would go for it. And that's, what, that's what's lacking. That's what needs to be re-enkindled within you. All right? Maybe you find out. Maybe you go deep within and you find out that you actually don't want Taurus. Or maybe you do. And you make the move. I leave you there. Let me know if you guys enjoyed this Crosswatcher. More importantly, let me know what sign you are if you resonated with this. This is interesting. This is an experiment that we are all part of and that we are all observing. See you guys soon.